There are a variety of ways that users can interact with Sync. To facilitate the management and permissions of these users, Logitech Sync now offers seven different roles. To add, remove, or edit users, simply navigate to the System tab on the left pane navigation. Make sure you're within the Users tab, then click Add a User. After inputting the new user email, simply assign one of the seven available roles, then click Send Invitation, and you're all set. Let's spend a minute covering the available roles. At the top of the list, with all permissions, is the owner. In addition to having access to any and every group, device, setting, and configuration, owners can uniquely add and remove users from the organization. Next are Sync Admins. They have access to groups designated by the owner, that is, rooms, devices, and settings, but cannot add or remove users. Device Admins can remove rooms and add rooms from their organization and configure and update devices, but they can't modify groups, update channels, or users. Device Managers can only configure and update devices. Read-only users can, of course, view information in sync, but do not have the ability to modify any configurations. And we're also offering a third-party role with the same permissions as the owner for their organization, but with a title that differentiates them from an internal user. And finally, there's the installer, which can add rooms, but cannot remove rooms, change settings, or manage users. And for more information about the role permissions, they're all available here on the right-hand side. That's a summary of user roles in Sync. Save time and energy by setting roles and permissions specific to the types of users in your organization.